Hey, Richard. Hey, how are you? All right. So you in the kitchen sink again, Well, huh? we've been using this prop for all kinds of things, you know, everything but the kitchen sink. So today we're actually going to talk about changing the kitchen sink. <laughs> all okay. right. So the standard size sink in America is 25 by 22 inches. And this is pretty much the builder's model, pretty shallow draft right here, and a pretty dated faucet. So if you can order the sink, the new sink, to the same size, you can get some different features. A little more style right here, a little higher level of finish on both sides, both the weight and the finish. Upgrade the basin and then maybe you got a new faucet here, so right, upgrade the faucet what, at the same this time. This is what everybody's looking for now, that pull down spray hose right here. Gotcha. So I thought we'd go step by step in how to change it safely. Okay. All right, so it starts, as always, by turning the water off. All right, turn off the hot. In the cold. Hopefully these hold. Double check that they held. Yep. Now break the connection. Good. So these are both broken now. So now on the drain, you got some choices about where you can break the connection. Anywhere there's a union nut, so to speak. So right here, right here, or this swivel right here. Simplest is just to break this top gasket right here, this top nut. Okay, so now that's completely clear. We've got nothing holding it to the, to the plumbing connections anymore. It's just the clips. So now these are clips we have to loosen. There's one. Kevin, I want you to work with me here. Just grab that putty knife and just score around the edge. This is the place where you can wreck the whole countertop. If you, if that... I will try not to wreck your whole countertop. Okay. You feel good? I'm gonna give it a little push, see if it comes up. Okay, in the back it's out, so try the front carefully, please. Okay, good. Thank you. All right, so that's going to fit perfectly. All right, so we can do some of this work up here instead of under the sink. Now, every sink needs a basket strainer, and so basket strainer, they keep changing it. You know, we're not going to actually use the putty. I've always oh, used putty, really? but this manufacturer, pretty interesting, they have a pre made gasket that'll act in lieu of the putty. So we're gonna, we're gonna trust it, I guess. Uh, I've always done putty, but they call out that this will do fine. Put that right there. And now I just have to catch that nut. Don't cross the thread. I won't, I promise. All right, so that should snug that up perfectly. All right, so for the faucet, we got a single hole faucet right here, but three holes here. One second, Kevin. They've made a pretty interesting plate. Again, there's really no need for putty. They've engineered it with a gasket on this side and a gasket on this side, and this is really heavy duty now. So this can go onto here and just stick that, stick all of it down in, inside. Good. Yeah, okay, it. good. So through. that's through. So here's our hot and cold. Here's our connection from our pullout spray. That's going to make this connection here. But we have to attach this shank, and they have a special bracket here. I'll show you. And a nut. Now, what's great is that there's this nut that's up in a tough place normally. Well, they make they provide a special tool with the faucet. Just pull this back, Kevin, just a second. So now with this, mm. we can make that up. 
Remember all the times I've shown you the basin wrench, that, that tool that was designed to fit in tight places? No, no more needed. And no this came needed. with the faucet? Yeah, it comes with the faucet. It's a Clever. disposable piece. So you'll have a hundred of these in your yeah. truck at some point. Yeah. Quite the collection. All right, faucet's connected, basket strand is connected. Now it's a lot easier to actually caulk this sink while it's up here too. So why don't you do that? Just go around with it. Okay, I'll do it. I was gonna get you to do it, Tom, I'll do it. Tom Sawyer. I'll do it. So now we're just gonna flip it over. Just grab this, careful. Try to drop it as true as we can. Nice. Okay, so now I'm gonna go underneath and make up the clips to hold it down and then reconnect the water and drain. So, if you order the sink same for same, it's a pretty interesting upgrade for, for not a lot of work. It's a pretty nice upgrade. Right. I mean, that's a big improvement. Right, it looks great, and uh, it, it's not too hard. It's very and homeowner friendly. I'll throw in the kitchen sink for you. You can repurpose this back at the house. You've never given me anything. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching. This old house has got a video for just about every home improvement project, so be sure to check out the others. And if you like what you see, click on the subscribe button. Make sure that you get our newest videos right in your feed.